I'd just like to talk about the UPEC Econ fingerprint scanner that I've just got for Christmas today. Um, I've just made a video and unboxing of it. I'm not sure if I'm going to upload that. I might, I might not. Um, I couldn't put everything in one video because I needed to restart my Mac in order to complete the installation. It's going to be a really quick video because I don't really have much to say about it. Um, here it is. If you can see that, I'll turn the camera. Really small, really light, looks really good as well. It works on both Mac OS X and Windows XP and Vista, I believe. Yes. So, it'll work with both major operating systems. It does, unfortunately, have a lot more functionality on Windows. Um, it, it has the two lists of what it can do on the back of the box there. You can see the Windows one is much longer. On Windows, you can log on, same as on OS X. Um, you just simply get the welcome screen, or whatever they call it on OS X. On both operating systems, you swipe your finger like that, and it automatically logs you on. In Mac OS X, you can also set that to unlock the keychain, which will... the keychain is the thing that remembers all your passwords in OS X, and it, it'll unlock that, and it's a more secure way of doing it, rather than just having it automatically unlocked. On Windows, you can use it in a web browser to remember all your passwords. Obviously, an OS 10 keychain will do that, and unlocking it at logon is just it's the same secure as far as security is concerned. It's probably more fun in Windows to swipe your finger every time you want to log into a website. It says RSA secure ID support. I'm not really sure what that is. I'll have to find that out. Workstation lock and unlock. Um, so you can lock windows. In OS X you can use it to resume from the screensaver I think. So if you, when your screensaver kicks in you swipe your finger to go back to the desktop. In both operating systems, OS X and Windows, you can use it for fast user switching. So rather than one person log off or click switch user, the next person type the password and log on. It's just a simple case of the other person swiping their finger instantly taken to their user account on their desktop. And one of the best features in Windows, I think, and for now, I, this is a reason why I wish I had Windows in here. Um, one of the best features for Windows users, I think, is you can assign each finger to a particular application or program. So, this is just an example. If I was using Windows here, I could assign, um, say, that finger to Microsoft Word, for example, and I could just swipe my finger any time I wanted, and it would open Microsoft Word. I could assign that to Firefox, swipe my finger, it would open Firefox, and so on. And you can use all ten fingers or all eight fingers and two thumbs. Um, it does let you swipe a thumb. So, uh, you, and you can also assign multiple fingers to log on in case you damage one of your fingers. So if you cut one of them, you wouldn't probably be able to swipe it. So you, I've, I've assigned my two index fingers for logging on. Um, I just wish for Mac OS X you could do more with it. Um, just some of the other things you can do with Windows. Don't know, hopefully they'll update the software, bring that f them features out another time. Just have to wait and see, but definitely for Windows users, this is a good product. The UPEC Econ Digital Privacy Manager, the fingerprint scanner. I picked this up from Amazon, or rather my parents did. Um, but I did ask for it, told them where they could get it from. Windows users, great product to buy. OS X users, it looks cool to sit on your desk, but to be honest, there's not really that much you can do with it. But if you are concerned about security, then it is a good way, a good thing to have, secure way to log on and unlock Keychain, which does hold all of your passwords. Would be a bit of a problem if someone found them. But it, it is just a really fun, cool way to log on, unlock things. Also in OS X you can use it, you, you need to swipe your finger to unlock um, some system preferences. Um, if, if you open 
system preferences you need to swipe your finger to make any changes in there so that's another security thing included for OS, for Mac users um, there's only one other good fingerprint reader I've seen out there and that's the Microsoft one um, I didn't get that for obvious reasons it's Microsoft it would only work with Windows as far as I believe and I could be wrong but I'm just assuming Microsoft wouldn't make something for OS 10 but please correct me if I'm wrong leave a comment you could also send me an email I'd also like to know what the Microsoft ones like if you've got it or if you've got another one completely or this one just leave your comments either for the, on this video or send me an email again info at jackie.com is my email address also got a live video stream I've been doing a 24 7 stream around Christmas I've been doing it for the last week I continue to do it until just after New Year probably and to go with the live video stream there is a live chat and there's always people in there talking so come come along jackie.com that's where you'll find us thanks for watching